Hi guys, welcome to Relax My Cat. My name is Savannah and here with me is the lovely Maya and today's video is all food based. So I think we are all super guilty of feeding our cats things that we definitely should not be feeding them like a piece of cheese every now and again and for the most part we can get away with these kinds of things. But not all the food that we can eat are safe for our cats and look at this. And I wanted to make a video about that so that makes this video. <laughs> yeah, so with that said, this video is three foods I bet you didn't know about for your cat. Well, not I bet. I feel like you might have guessed one or two. Ah! Savage! Alright, so we all know that dairy foods are really not the best to feed your cat, but um, I wanted to dig a little bit deeper and find some foods that were still really bad but um, not so much found on every single list that you would see. So ones that aren't very common, but still common enough to cause a threat. The first one is alcohol. I know the chances of your cat getting their nose in a bottle of rosé is pretty slim, but, but even a teaspoon of alcohol can cause serious problems for your cat. Look at this. There's nothing there. I think it's a little bit more realistic if you give them a piece of meat or chicken that's been cooked in like a, a wine sauce. Um, definitely stay away from that because alcohol is, again, really, really bad for cats and it can cause like liver failure really quickly, like within 12 hours, so stay clear. The next one was a little bit of a shock to me um, because it's one of my favorites and Maya has tried to eat one before and spat it out. Um, it's raisins and grapes. They're really, really dangerous for your cats, like, so I'm super glad that she spat it out. And as soon as I kind of found this one, I moved them from the bottom shelf where they are, right to the top, just, just in case, because this may be something that your cat actually will get their nose into and might try to eat. Raisins can lead to massive, massive kidney failure and, and death quickly following, so just try to keep them as far away from your cat as possible. And most fruit are not really great for cats anyways. Um, the last one, you may be thinking, why would my cat ever get this, but if you keep your cat off your counters when cooking, um, this should be fine, or just be vigilant if you drop any, it's dough, like uncooked baked goods, especially any doughs with yeast in, um, they expand in animals' stomachs, like to a massive degree, and then that's really painful for them, especially considering cat sizes and then what the yeast does once ingested is it turns into alcohol so yeah it turns into alcohol which makes it just like a double whammy for look at her trying to get this treat <laughs> a double whammy for dangerous I'm trying to be, ah I'm trying to be serious and you're biting me <laughs> so yeah definitely no yeast Maya is not a very helpful co-host today. <laughs> Honestly, to be safe, keep most uncooked things just away from your cat. A lot of lists say things like uncooked tuna and fish in very large um, quantities can be really dangerous and I think that's the mercury that can be found in certain fish. But yeah, most uncooked things, especially those with yeast in, keep them away. Your cat doesn't need them. Okay, um, since Maya has left me yet again. Don't mess up your nails, I just did those. Um, I will reveal our t-shirt winner da, 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 da. Um, this week so we have a t-shirt winner to announce and I'm gonna have a look now and see who has won okay okay so our winner this week of a relax my cat t-shirt is Dina Alhuri so well done congratulations everyone thank you so much for commenting as usual you are the best um, Dina, make sure you head over to our Instagram and DM, DM us your size and your address so we can get a shirt sent out for you. Um, anyone else who is still interested in winning one of our t-shirts, the competition is still ongoing. All you have to do is the following. Be subscribed to Relax My Cat and hit the bell beside it, just makes it a little bit easier. Um, and then post a comment within 60 minutes of this video going up, so an hour of this video going up. And that's it, you're entered. And we will tell you next week if you have won or not. Hey. <laughs> so again, thank you guys so much for tuning in. It really means a lot to me. And Maya. Doesn't it, Maya? That's a yes. <laughs> um, and I hope I will see you here again next week. Thank you so much. And I'll see you then. Bye-bye.